Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Before changing the layout of objects within the Layout Designer window, ensure that the margins and the grid shown on screen are set as needed. The margins and grid aid you in placing objects into the correct positions within the form so they will appear correctly when printed. To change the margin settings for the form, click the Margins button at the bottom of the window to open the Margins dialog box. You can input the desired margin width in inches into the top, bottom, left, and right fields shown. After setting the margins for the printed form, click the OK button to apply them to the view shown within the Layout Designer window. You can change the settings of the grid shown within the Layout Designer window by clicking the Grid button at the bottom of the window to open the Grid and Snap Settings dialog box. In this dialog box, you can hide the display of the grid within the Layout Designer window by removing the check mark from the Show Grid checkbox. If you do not want to have objects within the Layout Designer window align themselves to the grid when moving them, remove the check mark from the Snap to Grid checkbox. This allows for more precise placement of objects on screen, but makes aligning those same objects more difficult. Finally, you can change the amount of spacing between the lines in the grid by making a selection from the Grid Spacing drop-down menu. When you have finished changing any grid settings you want, click the OK button to apply them to the Layout Designer window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.